on the trading floor a quiet day, but not from the lack of news. The fact that we have no news is not good news. As politicians work feverishly on Capitol Hill to solve the nation's debt crisis, investors on Wall Street are anxiously awaiting a resolution. The fact that the markets aren't getting hit right now, um, I think is showing that investors feel that we're not in that panic mode just yet, but have to wait and see. We are coming really down to the deadline, and, and as hours pass, it's really going to make an effect on our markets. The yeah. Dow spent the day down a little less than a percent, a slight loss in the face of ongoing uncertainty. But investors overall believe a deal not only will, but has to be reached. If you poll 98 percent of the people down here, they don't think anyone in government on either side would be that foolish. Investors still just can't believe that Congress would allow the credit rating of the U.S. government to fall from its AAA standing. Uh, I think that they realize how much is at stake uh, and that they will probably come to some sort of an 11th hour agreement. If an agreement isn't reached by August 2nd, it could have a catastrophic impact on financial markets. Many analysts predict it could be as bad as the 2008 crisis. 2008 wasn't that long ago when people saw their 401ks become 101ks. This is real. Just from a, a psychological point of view, if something was going to happen, you were going to see tremendous waves, trickle effect that going to go to other economies, other markets uh, globally. Risk of a first ever federal default would not only wreak havoc on financial markets here and abroad, but with an already fragile economy, analysts wonder if the U.S. can withstand another financial disaster. In New York, Bonnie Ghosh, Associated Press.